it's June and welcome back to my channel. I know, new background, right? We're still, we're still gonna fix it up because I see a little shadows, maybe do white, I don't know. But anyway, that's not what this video is about. This video is about week four in my hair growth challenge with garlic, with garlic and castor oil. Um, I don't know if you guys are doing this with me, but I seem to love the, I really like the outcome of what's going on or the progress. Now, I don't really see a difference from last week to this week. I really don't. To me, it looks the same, but that's okay. I'll take it and I'm still going to do it. Um, if you guys are doing something else, feel free feel free to do something else. If you're doing one of my other challenges, please write down below. Let me know what you're doing. I'm always interested in, in hearing what you guys are doing for hair growth. And a lot of people are saying that the garlic and the castor oil are working for them. And that just gives me so much hope. And that's what I need. I need hope. I need to hear from you guys saying that this is really, really good. And um, a lot of you were asking me, am I going to be incorporating other things into this mixture for hair growth? And no, I'm just going to stick with the garlic and the castor oil. And if you're new here and you want to see how I prepared this recipe, at the end of this video, I will have the video listed up here or you'll, you'll see it somewhere on this, on, on this video. It's usually the last 20 seconds of the video. You will see um, four, at least four little boxes, and they will have the hair growth challenge, and I will have just everything up here. So you can just, they're like clickable links, and you might see a card. Actually, if you want to see um, my hair growth challenge that I'm doing now, I have a card right up here, right there. See, it just popped out. You can click on that. That will take you to hair growth challenge if you want to start over, you know, if you want to start and uh, do it with me. Anyway, but um, yeah, I don't really see such a difference. And like I said, that's okay. As long as it didn't like stop or reversing, it's fine. Um, like I said, the garlic does not smell up your hair, which I am, I'm so surprised the garlic does not smell, you know, like leave a lingering smell. It doesn't. Uh, the first time that I had to wash my hair out, I had to do it twice because I felt like I can smell it. My daughter didn't smell it. Um, but now as I do it, I, I only shampoo, conditioner, and I use the Dr. Organics, which I love because it's great for hair growth. So that's what I'm doing with that. I'm not using regular shampoo and conditioner because I don't want to risk that it's going to clog the hair follicles. So I will have the link to Dr. Organics shampoo and conditioner if you want. Um, and the castor oil and the brush that I'm using for um, scalp massaging. I'll leave all those links down below. But um, yeah, so I, I happen to like what's going on with my head. I put my hair up the other day because sometimes at night I put my hair up right now it used to be when I put my hair up okay when I put my hair up you saw a lot more scalp than I do now so you know I'm pretty happy with that you know I've had some compliments from my daughters because I don't walk around with my hair just out like this and my scalp showing in my house and I know that I should feel comfortable doing that but I I'm not saying anybody would judge me or look at me in in like like disgust because nobody would in my house we're just not like that I for myself I don't like the way it looks so I don't walk around like this but my kids have seen me like during the day my hair would be up my hair would be down and they even made um some well the compliments they have complimented my hair and said you know well wow, looks like your hair got thicker thank you thank you so much uh yeah so this is it I'm loving it. I'm hoping you guys are sticking with it. And that's it. I guess that's it, right? Um, okay, until next time. I'll see you in week five. I hope I have a really, really good... Uh, oh, and another thing. Somebody told me that the garlic will help with the grays. Is that true? I mean, I'm hoping that's true because my grays come out so fast and I have to tell you I dyed it when did I dye it last last week I dyed it and I really don't see grays like coming up so I don't know if it's the dye because I'm using that other dye what's it called 
it's in my other video and I'll have that listed over here <coughs> hair something oh I forgot the name of it it's supposed to be all natural and people are saying that it's not I don't know but it's more it's it's much better than the store-bought like the CVS brand not CVS brand like pharmacy you know like L'Oreal Revlon all that it's supposed to be better um so yeah I don't know if it's because of that dye or because of the garlic I don't know but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this video I know it's short but I don't know what else to talk about I am going to go live maybe this week and um I will let you guys know I'll put it up on YouTube when I will go live this way if you want to ask me questions I can answer them it would be really really nice to you know get a more personal feel and answer your questions in real time and uh, that's all I have today guys I hope you enjoyed this video I know I'm just yapping 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 it's time to close this video right now I will see you next week next Monday for week five okay have a great week guys Bye.